In this video, help me break down this photo. Let's go. All right, guys, welcome back to yet another video of the photo breakdown where I break down a photo bit by bit with the light setup, the camera settings and more information behind the photo. But before we break down this photo set, I need you guys to like this video. If you're new here, subscribe to this channel, hit that bell button so you get notified every single time I drop a new video for you guys. I have a challenge for you. I need you guys to let me know how long you think it took for us to do this photo shoot. Drop your time in the comments and at the end of this video, I will let you know exactly how long it took us to get this photo shoot done. So now, Kay's been doing a few competition looks for Halloween, and in this case, we're gonna call this one the spider look. She says, Ray, let's do a quick photo shoot. I said, all right, let's do it. I wanted to go with a different setup than I usually go with, so for this photo set, I used two lights. The key light you see on your screen is the AD600. The modifier I used is the parabolic seven foot umbrella, and right behind Kay, I have an AD200 gelled with blue. I want to apologize for the terrible BTS video quality. Um, I was in a rush and I just put this together so you guys can benefit from this video. This photo shoot was done at home in my living room and I'm shooting against my white wall. So here's where the technical settings come in. First, I set up the AD200 with the blue gel behind K and I tested my lighting with that setting first. The purpose for this was to create somewhat of a gradient from light blue to dark blue. I put the AD200 on a stand and set it right behind K to the height of about her hips. Mind you, she is standing. This keeps that light hot right in that area and the spill of that light as it gradually goes up will start getting a little bit darker. So it creates somewhat of a gradient. The power for that light was set to one over 128. So that way it wasn't too hot and just overexposing the backdrop. So now this is where I add the key light, the AD400. I angle the umbrella right above K so that way the light can spill and splash down towards the reflector, fill in those shadows under her, but also reflect back to her face and also give her catch lights. All right, now down to the camera settings. So I did use a 70 to 200 millimeter lens on this photo set. And that's because I just love the compression that the 70 to 200 brings to any photo. I wanted to separate K from the backdrop or the white wall with the blue gel. And the 70 to 200 is a lens that's capable of doing that. K stood about four feet away from the wall, which helps in creating that nice gradient with the colored gel. The set focal length on this picture is 84 millimeters. The shutter speed is at one over 1250, with the aperture being at 3.2 and the ISO at 400. All right, guys, this was a simple photo shoot. Like I said, it was just for one of Kay's Halloween competition looks. However, I wanted to make a video that can help you guys out in understanding how I set up the lights and ended up creating these photos. So back to that challenge that we were talking about in the beginning of the video. The total time it took for us to do this quick photo shoot was a total of eight minutes and 32 seconds. Was you close? Let me know. If you have any questions about the gear used in this video or anything at all about this photo set, drop them down in the comments and I'll be more than happy to help you guys out. I always appreciate the support you guys give me by simply watching my videos and giving them a like. So if you haven't already done so, give the video a like, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell button. Thanks for watching.